Hello, how do you solve this exponential problem? x to the power of x equals x to the power of 4. Solving for the value of x that satisfies this equation. Now, if you consider this identity, if you have a to the power of b and equals a to the power of c, since the bases are the same, you can have b equals c. Then that means you compare the exponents. So by doing that here, we can say that x equals 4. But this is just one of the solutions because we have other solutions right here. Now, in order to solve this and get all the solutions, we can make use of natural log. Of natural log of x power x equals natural log of x to the power of 4. Now, consider this identity. If you have log a to the power of b, this equals b log a. That means natural log to the power of natural log of a to the power of b equals b times natural log of a. So that means this x here will come behind this natural log. We have x times natural log of x equals, for this, that means the 4 will come behind this natural log. We have 4 times natural log of x. Now, this is a simple equation that we can decide to form an equation if we want, or also we can easily just divide it. That means I can have x times ln x divided by ln x equals 4 times ln x divided by ln x, right? This cancel this, this cancel this. That means x equals 4. Now I can also take it off from here. If I have x times ln x equals 4 times ln x, I can move this over here. That means x ln x minus 4 ln x equals 0, right? So I can factor out ln x. I have ln x times this divide ln x. I have x minus this divide ln x. I have 4. And this equals 0. So from here, I can have ln x equals 0. I can also have x minus 4 equals 0. So to solve for x, here, I can make use of e of e power ln x equals e power 0. e raised to the power of ln cancel out. That means we have x equals e power 0. And in number or alphabet raised to the power of 0 is 1. So we have x equals 1. For this other one here, this is a linear equation. I move negative 4 over here. of x equals 4. This is my x2. This is my x1. So we have gotten two values using this approach compared to this other one that we had only one value, which is x equals 4. Now, that's interesting. We can also solve this whole equation, x power x equals x power 4, using a different approach. I can divide this by x power 4. I divide this by x power 4. Now, remember, if you have a power n, divided by a power m, this equals a power n minus m, right? So. I can simply have x power x minus 4 because this will come up using this identity and this cancel itself is equals 1. So we can then apply the natural law right now. Our natural law of x power x minus 4 equals natural law 1. And remember the identity if you have natural law a power p equals p times natural log a. Using this identity, that means x minus 4 comes behind this. We have x minus 4 natural log x equals natural log 1. So right here you have x minus 4 natural log x equals natural log 1 here is 0. So this means we can equate each of these to 0 as x minus 4 equals 0, and natural log x equals 0. So to solve this individual equation, let's start with this one here. I'm going to get the 4 over here. Half x equals 4, so this is my x1. For this, I make use of e. If you ask e power ln x equals e power 0. e eliminate ln. Have x equals e power 0. 
from here I can have x equals e power 0 is 1. I still end up having the two values. So guys, we can check. x equals 4, x equals 1. And remember, the question remains x power x equals x power 4. Let's start with when x equals 4. We have 4 power 4 equals, and also we have x power 4 here. That means 4 power 4. So 4 power 4, 4 is FF squared, this is 2 power 2. 4 power 4 equals 2 power 2, or power 4. So by multiplying this exponent, we have 2 power 8 equals 2 power 8. And 2 power 8 is simply 2, 5, 6. And this equals 2, 5, 6. This has proven to be correct. Let's consider when x equals 1. We have x power x equals x power 4. Now x equals 1. We have 1 power 1 equals 1 power 4. 1 power 1 is 1 equals 1 power 4 or 1 raised to the power of any number is 1. We have 1 here. This also has satisfied the equation. So guys, the two values have proven to be correct. That means for you to get two values, you need to consider making use of this natural log method. So that is it. Thank you and goodbye.